Human Powered Wearables Future wearable devices might not have a battery. Instead, the battery is you. Researchers developed wearable technology that is basically powered by the human body. The technology uses thermoelectric generators, converting the body's internal temperature to electricity to provide power. The technology combines a stretchy material called polyamine, thermoelectric chips and liquid metal wires that can be worn either on your wrist or like a ring on your finger. Advantage of this technology is, whenever you use a battery, you are depleting that battery and will eventually need to replace it, but using thermoelectric devices that you can wear it and it provides you with constant power. In future this technology will potentially replace batteries on wearable devices. Artificial eyes look to the future. Scientists can't yet rebuild someone with bionic body parts. They don't have the technology. But a new artificial eye brings one step closer to reality. This device, which mimics the human eye's structure, is sensitive to light and has a faster reaction time than a real eyeball. It may not come with the telescopic or night vision capabilities, but this electronic eyepiece does have the potential for sharper vision than human eyes. In the future, we can use this for better vision prostheses and humanoid robotics. Smart sutures that detect infections. Sutures are the threads used to close up a wound. They hold large wounds or incisions together so that they can heal. But sometimes wounds don't heal properly. Tissues can swell and bulge, causing the sutures to tighten. That can create an ugly scar. Or, the wound may become infected. That causes the tissue to redden and heat up. So researchers figured out a way to transform sutures into sensors. These special stitches can report what's going on beneath a bandage. They even can send out health dispatches from inside the body. Now, researchers have developed smart sutures that can alert caregivers when problems emerge. Future versions might even be able to deliver drugs to help a stitched up wound heal. Bricks turned into energy storing devices. Researchers have found a way to turn the red bricks in our walls into power banks that can be used to store energy. Bricks, as the cheapest and most commonly found construction material on the planet, could have a secondary purpose that would replace inverters and generators. Ordinary red bricks can be converted into energy storage devices called supercapacitors by coating the brick with PEDOT, a conductive polymer. It's made up of nanofibers that work through the network of a brick. PEDOT coated bricks are ideal building blocks that can provide power to emergency lighting. Such a solution could have numerous applications in developing countries like India, where energy supply is not reliable. Robotic Guide Dogs Guide dogs are very useful to people who are blind or have low sight, but they have their limitations. The first is that it takes a lot of time and money to train a dog. Another drawback with guide dogs is their inability to read a map and then use it to navigate to a desired location. In this new effort, the researchers have developed a robot dog that is able to carry out the duties of a live guide dog as well as provide additional services. More work will need to be done before the robot dog is ready to lead a person who is blind in a real-world setting.